liquored up. He drank about 10 beers with Parma Dave. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, Parma Dave. Great sponsor, ParmaDaveRacing.com and Parma, Parma, Ohio. Parma Dave has all your racing parts available. If you need a bike rebuilt, Parma Dave will take it apart right in front of you. He will show you what's wrong and he will fix it in a matter of no time. ParmaDaveRacing.com Also another sponsor we'd like to say, little side-by-side -side action there. Jordan Aldridge, I believe that was, making the pass on the inside. Or Jordan Swainy, I'm sorry. But uh, another sponsor of ours, like to thank Duct Tape, and most importantly, like to thank McCoon, Cycle World, and KTM. Great friends, great sponsors. Wouldn't be out here without you. Meanwhile, some guys up there in the woods, slowing down. We go with the prom. I don't think he got drunk, but he went to the prom, came back out the next day, and kicked some ass on the dirt bike track. Meanwhile, you hear those guys roaring through the woods. They'll be coming right into your screen in just a moment. Here comes one of them. there folks check it out I want one of those I need one of those so all you guys that are watching out there you need to pitch in and buy me one or pay my tuition in college either one whichever one you feel more comfortable we'll be right back we got to change the battery hopefully no one oh yeah yeah there's the guy who's stealing all the rocks for today to go home and make his house look better Here comes our good friend, Gary. Oh, look at him go! Made the pass right there on the inside. Holding his ground today. Gary had a rough start, but he looks like he's moving pretty fast now. That's it. You see, I can't be forced. I'm fat. I know I'm retarded, but I'm fat. So technically, I can't be forced. Those two battled each other out. Good 
bumper into the bar bomber class there. We'll be right back with more action at White Earth the Sport. Oh yeah. Give each other a little battle side by side. Comes that orange KTM machine. Get him after the race. It's too quick for me to catch right now. Wow, more racing action. Meanwhile, um, we'd like to wish the best of luck to the young man who wrecked earlier. You seen he endowed going down that little drop off. I was told that he was injured a little bit, but nothing too serious. He, he was able to get up and walk it off after a while. So we wish him the best of luck, a speedy recovery. I'm sure he's going to be out for a couple weeks. A little bit bruised up, but uh, tough sport. And all these guys can handle it. We'll be right back on the wide earth of sports. Stay tuned for more racing action. There's Carl Kuntz, the man who loves to hit trees. You can tell he's not a hippie because he loves hitting trees. i tell you what, folks, this has been one hell of a racetrack. And I'm sure these guys will tell you they've had more fun today and they've had a long, long time. Not taking away from anything but the other track. It's a nice, warm, beautiful day. That's right. It's a nice, warm, beautiful day out here. And beautiful track, beautiful scenery coming in here. I'll show you in just a second as these guys pass. Right over there is a nice, big lake. The only thing missing now is a six pack of Bud Light and the Fisher Rod. Racing this week in honor of his brother Jeremy. Dave, I know what you're going through. I lost my uh, stepbrother a couple, or, uh, here a while back. That's going on seven years ago. I know it doesn't get any easier. <laughs> you move on, but it doesn't get any easier. So my thoughts and prayers are out to your family. We wish you and your family the best.